Hi guys, Thomas here, Spacelink TV. I'm back with another amazing science of life on Mars episode 3. I've been looking a bit forward for this because in episode 1 we had this picture up you are looking at here now of the so called foundation which is 2 times 2 meters big, not very big but big enough to be visible and you can clearly see it looks like some kind of rectangular foundation. There are some other pictures of other features similar but taken from another angle more from the downside and up like you see here. This is from Seoul 1117 which is more than 500 days later than the picture we just saw. That to me looks like the similar features in the distance. But when we get closer to it and we will get a little bit closer uh, in just a second you see that the rocks, the blocks, they're like fitted together. They looks like they're molded together or fitted in together, like like we see it from uh, uh, Peru, Bolivia, uh, and, uh, and all the ancient sites. We all remember the rocks that, that looks like it has cut and has been shaped like a little jigsaw puzzle. Here you see it a little bit closer and look over to the left side. You can see how the rocks they are not the same rocks but they are fitted in to fit together and it does look like they are placed there by some kind of intelligence being. What can I say? Leave a comment on it in comment box below. The other picture here from uh, Mars is uh, originally found and posted by Brian Hopkins. Uh, it's a great picture what has been named uh, the concrete bunker who give it the name i don't know but yeah it does look like a concrete uh, bunker and it is a great find uh, by brian it's been posted around uh, social medias for for years now and it has the features of a bunker and the angles the rectangular angles there is another picture of it i made this one of the same uh, this anomaly is no more than about 40 to 60 centimeters long with the two to uh, concrete blocks together so this is not a tiny little thing and i remember when he got the name concrete bunker i thought concrete was okay because it looks like concrete but I is it a bunker i'm not sure about that uh, the size compared 40 to 60 uh, centimeters what do you guys think do you think this is a concrete bunker on mars uh, let me know, leave a comment in the comment box below. We got the spoon on Mars. This is also a great, great picture. I really, really love this one. I had this one with me to, uh, I have had all these pictures uh, with me to the Mars conference in 2015 and 2016 uh, and 2017 when we were online. So, uh, this picture spoon on Mars, just look at it. Tell me, what do you see? I see a spoon. And, and, and if you look at the size of the anomaly in the little round box in the middle of the picture, and then compare it to the size of the wheel of cu the Curiosity rover that you can see in the bottom, the Curiosity rover's wheel is 14, 40 centimeters wide. So copy the anomaly with your eyes and put it in front of the rowers wheel visually uh, in your head and, and you will realize that this object is about 10 to 15 centimeters long which fits with a size of a normal spoon. I could find one in my kitchen drawer, same size. I think this is a great, great picture. Are we looking at a spoon on Mars or is it just a trick of light or a natural formation? I don't know guys, I'm asking you, this one is really, really tricky. We've seen so many things that look like artificial creative stuff on Mars and this is one more of them. Leave a comment in the comment box below and tell me what you think we are looking at. Tool on Mars. I remember this one so well. This was one of the first ones that I really studied. Uh, it comes from the old spirit rover, rest in peace spirit. And what you see is something that looked like twisted metal with, with, with something like a U-shaped gap uh, at the end that looked like a tool or a spanner or I, I'm not sure what it is. Uh, um, but I'm asking you guys, what do you guys think we are looking at here? Are we looking at something metallic, twisted 
a bended uh, that don't belong there, or is it just uh, again a, a trick of light and, and rocks we are looking at? I do find uh, the old Spirit Rovers uh, pictures amazing, and this was one of those pictures that caught my attention uh, when I started uh, Anomaly Hunting back in 2011. Uh, so, yeah, my heart belongs to Spirit Rover, rest in peace. This great picture, I remember presenting it uh, as a tool and as a spanner. I'm, I'm not sure I would believe it uh, today that it is a tool or a spanner, but I definitely don't think it belongs on the surface, looking like it does right here, right now. Come on, guys, leave a comment in the comment box uh, below and tell me what do you think we are looking at here on Mars? What did Spirit Rover capture? Tree stump found on Mars by Neville Thompson. I remember this great, great picture. To me, it does look like a tree stump, uh, and I do think that it actually is a tree stump, or is it a rock uh, protruding up from, from underground? Uh, I don't know. I, I would love to believe that this is a, a tree stump, and I th thank you, uh, Neville Thompson. Many times for his uh, great finding, all credit to, to Neville for uh, this one. Are we looking at a tree stump found on Mars, caught by Curiosity Rover? I don't know, I am asking you. I uh, have another picture of it, uh, that's my own uh, version of it, uh, in two different color solutions. Are we looking at a tree stump on, on Mars? I think we are looking at something that... that hadn't been explained by NASA uh, because if we are looking at a tree stump that means there would be biological uh, uh, life on Mars, plant life on Mars and if there's biological and plant life on Mars there's gonna be more to it. So tell me in the comment box below what are we looking at today on this picture from Curiosity Rover. Guys, this is a short one today. Thank you for watching. Remember to uh, like and subscribe and click the notification button so you get a notification next time we have an amazing science of life on mars uh, and that would be episode number four thank you for watching until we see you again take care bye